so I just want to share this little plant haul um, that I got from a nursery that's um, not in my area but it's not far from me um, so I went in I was just looking around looking for some birthday gifts for um, my sibling and I found that this nursery had a, a shelf with free plants so um, I went over there and I got quite a few free things which is nice because then I can give my sister some free plants and I didn't have to you know buy her a ton of plants like I was going to so one of the things that was free is this calla lily um, I'm not sure on their care but I'm actually gonna give this I'm gonna trim it up a little bit and then I'm gonna give this to my mom to take care of um, I usually get her a lily every year for Easter anyway so hopefully she won't she won't look at this and be like what is this because it's not like the usual um, Easter lily that I typically get her with the big tall white flowers and I'll probably take off the free tag so she's not like ah. but anyway so they also were giving these free little baby fiddle leaf figs away so I got one for my mom and for my sister um, they do have they each have a leaf that's kind of broken um, and then this one has some little damage to it but that's not a huge deal <clears throat> for me plus um, you know they grow new leaves all the time or at least now in spring so they'll be fine this begonia here was free now I'm not sure what kind of begonia this is I don't know if this is an outdoor or indoor he was just on the shelf with the free one so um, I took him I'll probably give give this guy to my mom as well and let her um, figure him out I'm not really I'm kind of happy with the begonia collection that I do have um, yeah this probably will I'll probably give this to her because I'm not I'm not in the market I guess for any more begonias at the moment um, so the next plant I got was this guy here um, it's a snake plant, a Sansevieria. Um, he was not free, so I actually did pay uh, $5.99 for him. And he's really, really cute. He's going to be, he's a birthday gift um, for my sister. Uh, another plant that I got is this right here. So this is a Macaulay's Finale. It looks very similar to the uh, Prince of Orange but it's different um the leaves and the color colors are, are are much different it does have the orange tones but it has a lot of um it's just a different 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 color if you if i put them together um you'd be able to tell matter of fact i'll just go get my prince of orange and we can um, compare them hang on one second here they both are this is the macaulay's finale which you can see right here and here is the Prince of Orange um, they're very very similar there are some differences um, I feel like the leaves on the Prince of Orange are a lot lighter you can see some variations um, in the Macaulay's leaves they're very dark deep deep hues this is very like a maroon red reddish with some yellow undertones it's just it's it's a very much the same but very different I don't know how it's how to explain it um, very well but if you just see this is the Prince of Orange he's got a new leaf coming his leaves come in bright bright orange like a reddish orange it's very very pretty if you see these here these are very green now they have some hint like some hues of orange and maroon in them but they're not as as dark as the finale so just take a look here at these two now the finale that I just got is much fuller 
than the Prince of Orange, and that's because there's three plants um, in the finale, and the Prince of this, my Prince of Orange is just one. So I'll show you the three different. Um, so here's here's one right here. I see I'm moving that. Here's a separate a separate baby right there, and then there's a third in the back here. So right there, this guy is. Uh, three plants in one um, so he's he's very full and I love a full plant um, so I think he's gonna be really really gorgeous I want to get him a nice uh, white pot and I think that'll really set set him off and have those leaves really pop in the summer and my Prince of Orange he's already in white he's already popping he's got a new leaf coming up um, and he's doing really 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 well I'm very very proud of this plant um, and how easy he, he's been to take care of. So enough with the Prince of Orange. I did want to share one more plant that I got for free. Um, and I have it quarantined because I um, saw, I think it's, it's mealybugs right away when I got him home. So I took him away from my other plants. But I'm going to show you... Um, him right now and then I'm gonna show you the mealy bug so here he is right here is a Dracaena and let me see if I can focus in on the mealy bug here put this down so I I did decide that I will go ahead and try treatment on him I really don't want this to spread to any of my other plants this I, I really don't I don't like to deal with with the bug. So if you see that little white thing right there, that's a mealy bug. I, I can't get any closer without it getting blurry, but if you look here in the crown of the plant, you can see how it's kind of fuzzy, fuzzy down there. And there's some mealy bugs down there. Here goes. Here goes one right there. So I noticed that right off the bat. Hopefully you know, on their car ride home, they didn't spread um, to any other plants, but I will quarantine. But this is this is why you should look at your plants that you're planning on purchasing very well before you leave the store. Um, just to make sure that you're not bringing anything else home to infect the rest of your collection. Um, but I was so excited because all these free plants, so I'm just grabbing plants and throwing them in the car and not even thinking about checking for bugs and then I got home like you know what I should probably look these over and then sure enough we got a mealy bug so I am gonna treat him and keep him separate um hopefully he can get over you know his bug issue and then he can be will be a gift as well all right guys thank you for watching this oh I do have one more thing to show you so let me not end this video right now all right so when I went to Aldi's yesterday grocery shopping, I found these. It's a plant caddy. And basically, like the picture, you just stick your pot on here. Makes it easy to move plants around. I have two big plants um, that I'm going to use to put on here. So my Monstera is going to go on one of these. And then my, uh, my rubber tree is going to go on because they're pretty big plants. Um, and it just may, it'll make it a lot easier just to move them about um, the house. So.